One year ago, I bought my first camera without really knowing what to do with it. And now I'm asking myself, why am I doing this? Hey guys, what's up? Thank you very much for tuning in to my channel today. I have an announcement to make, but before I do that, I would like to go a little back to tell you a bit more about it so that you can really understand every step of the story. You have to know I have always been fascinated with filmmaking. In my early days, together with my best friend Marco, we started to make stop motion movies with Legos and we filmed lightsaber battles as if we were in Star Wars and stuff like that. So it was pretty ridiculous, but it was like the coolest thing to do for me. When we got older, we started the band and the best thing besides from going crazy on stage was shooting and editing our own music videos together with a very talented talented guy named Simon which has his own film company which supported us with all his fancy equipment and showed us and taught us how to do all those things. The time in the band also showed me that one thing that makes me really happy is to entertain other people. If it is by playing a concert in front of strangers or throwing a New Year's Eve party for all my friends, I think one of the best feelings for me is just when I can make other people have a good time. We kept on with playing music but as the time went by our real lives just got more and more in the way. We started studying, we had our jobs, and I started a four years bachelor degree in mechanical engineering, which I did part-time. That means I studied in evening classes and during the day I had to work. As you can think, that was quite time consuming. But last year, I bought a little action camera and together with my girlfriend, Megan, we went to the Reifenbach Falls here in Switzerland and I just pressed that record button and pointed it at random things like a maniac. When I got home and started to edit this footage, I rediscovered my passion for filmmaking. I spent hours and hours editing this video, trying out different things, and then we shot like those scenes in my living room with self-made like lights and stuff. Marco was supporting me with his camera and his knowledge. And yeah, that's basically how my first video was made. At this point, my vision about my project was very clear. I wanted to combine my passion for filmmaking and being outdoors in the nature and produce informational and inspirational videos about my adventures. Like that, Outdoors with Sandro was born. I was hustling very hard. I was editing all the time. I started an Instagram account. I learned about photography, learned about Photoshop and Lightroom. And I was trying out different kind of videos to see what works best for me and also for you guys. And next to that, I was making a living with my job. I was preparing for exams and writing a thesis. Four weeks ago, the big day has arrived. I could hand in my thesis and now the school is over and now I finally got my degree in mechanical engineering. I thought that this would make me really happy, but honestly, after a few days, I just felt empty and a bit sad because a really big part of my life, which gave me purpose and approval, just went missing like that. This really made me think about myself, my life and the person I want to be. And I also started overthinking my YouTube channel and I ended up with the big question, why am I doing this? Is it the likes, the followers? Am I chasing any kind of fame? Am I a narcissist or am I just making a fool out of myself by acting like an influencer on like this small YouTube channel? I tried to get to the bottom of this question because I really wanted to figure out if all of this is like something that really makes me happy. I thought about what I've achieved so far. And I mean, if you only look at the numbers, you could think that it's a total waste of time. But during this year, I met so many inspiring people, not all of them in person, but also online. And I've been to some places that I honestly don't know if I would have ever visited if it wasn't for making another video. When I scroll through my old videos, I feel kind of proud. I know that it's not much, but it really makes me feel like I've created a little something. Maybe I've watched one of my videos and it made you smile, or maybe you were inspired to go outside and experience some nature for yourself. And if that's the case, I think all of this is very much worth it. So if you are still watching at this point, first of all, thank you very much for your time. I appreciate it. And second of all, here it comes, the reason for this whole story here. I would like to take this here, our relationship, and this channel to another level. And therefore, Megan and me have been brainstorming for quite a while during the last few days. We were looking for ways to keep this content interesting for you, even if you're not planning to visit Switzerland within the next few months. And I would still like to entertain you with weekly videos, but I would also like to pursue a bigger project. So here it is. I want to make a movie. Make a movie. 
I won't make an action movie with fighting scenes or like a romantic comedy with <laughs> Julia Roberts or something. No, no, I will stick to my Switzerland slash outdoors slash traveling kind of content. No worries. I want to make a complete entire travel guide about Switzerland. I know there are a lot of great videos on YouTube, but mostly about like single places like Zermatt, Luzern, whatever. But I, I want it all. I want to go, I want to go for gold. Like I want the first prize in the Olympic medal category of Switzerland movies, if that's a thing. It's not a thing, but it's a fact. I still have to work. I mean, I work four days a week and I only have like the weekends. So I can't really tell you when it will be done. But I think and I hope and I try my best that it will be out within the next four to six months. But if you're now thinking that you won't hear anything from me until it's out, then you're wrong. I got you. I won't let you down because we had a good idea. I will try to post a weekly vlog about how we make this movie. You got me? Just like good content that you can check in with me once a week. I hope that sounds like a good idea to you. So yeah, this is it. That is the big announcement. There is a huge project waiting for us and I'm so excited to do it all of this and take you guys with me. Alrighty, that's it. Thank you so much for watching this video and for your time, I appreciate it. So there's only one thing left to do. If you haven't subscribed yet, then hit that button right now because there will be the first vlog in about a week and like that, you won't miss it. And you can join this whole journey and it would be awesome to have you on board. If you have any questions, that's what the comment section is for. Just write some kind words. I will answer every single one of them. And finally, the thumbs up button is as always a very nice gift that you can make me because like this, this video gets seen a bit more often. I don't mind that. So I wish you a great day, a great week, wherever you are. And uh, I will see you in a week when the first vlog will be out. Stay safe and goodbye.